forget how to do stuff. <laughs> nice cough. Thank you. I've had it for years. <laughs> I hope you like it. Uh, hey, it's when made I was, the pandemic fun. When I was fresh out of high school, I was dating a gal, and uh, I convinced her that I was into coughing. So every time she <laughs> coughed, I just I just feel like oh. <laughs> And, and we were together for like okay, what? we we were together for like four years, and I kept it up the whole time. That's a that's actually dedication. incredible. Oh, turn out it's me, your Australian friend. Like, right, listen, meet me at the Outback Steakhouse. Right, we'll get a blooming onion. <laughs> Pick up a can of Fosters and we'll have a fish on the barbie. That's your... A lot of Australians do say <laughs> listen a lot. That's accurate. That's your pretty good accent. Right, listen, Chana, we're going to go to the Dracula musical dinner theater. <laughs> I feel like they would say theater. We're going to go to the dinner theater. Dracula musical, <laughs> man. Fucking hey, man. It's going to be great. You haven't called me a cunt yet. Cunt. Oh, Chino, you fucking cunt. We're gonna pick you up in the Subaru. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Australian viewers. <laughs> but I'll take you to really. the Dracula Dinner Theater. <laughs> I don't know if I have any Aussie viewers, but I don't anymore. Who's that? Oh, a banana. Rex. <laughs> Your turn now. In the Subi. Alright. We're gonna get Chan out after that and go to the Dracula Dinner Theater. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know what the fuck you're talking about. I don't want to see the Dracula. Good. How are you, my friend went to Australia. Necro. He said that everyone at the hostel that he stayed at kept trying to take him to a Dracula Dinner Theater. <laughs> <laughs> so apparently that's a thing Australians the fuck do. Fuck is a Dracula at least they Dinner did in Theater. 2011. I was wondering the same thing. Oh, Rex, what are you doing, man? <laughs> <laughs> the further you can push your front teeth over your lower lip. <laughs> We're not going to have any British or Australian viewers. So I was talking about this the other day, and I realized, like, when people make fun of Canadians and they're like, Hey, bud, why don't you go out and get a maple syrup? <laughs> <laughs> if somebody does an accent like that, I just don't care. So I assume that when I do one like that for British people, they also don't care. <laughs> oh, my God. <sighs> hey, what's going on, man? We're going to play some ice hockey later. <laughs> Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> My fucking face hurts. <laughs> ah. <laughs> My friend was dating this really stupid chick, and we would we would give him shit for it. Like, he was dating her because she was really attractive and she had very large boobs. <laughs> but, she, but she was right. just stupid. Like, it's unfortunate to call someone stupid, but this was a dumb person. <laughs> and uh okay he we were hanging out in the hallway and he slipped on a like lays there's a, a, a an empty chip bag on the ground and he slipped and hit the ground and like we all laughed at him and then she goes what did, what happened and then he went oh, I, I slipped on that chip bag and then she went, what's a chip bag? <laughs> and I fucking oh, I think about that every time <laughs> what's I say a chip what's bag? a bag. I don't know how much of the ass eating thing is just a meme or if people like, you know, actively are like, oh, my God, I can't wait to eat some ass. <laughs> can't wait to eat ass, dude. <laughs> I remember when when I was a, a teen, uh, one of my friends was like yo bro do you fucking eat ass and i was at that point in time i was like no he's like just do it it's right there <laughs> it's right there what kind of convincing argument is Thanks, that 
I mean, it, it worked. Thank you. Some Sometimes I think about, like, uh, I mean, you already know that this is going to be nothing that no one else thinks of, but... I'm ready to hit sometimes, me. Sometimes I'll just think of, like, Filipino dads singing karaoke. <laughs> <laughs> what? Okay. <laughs> but they're like they're like divorced Filipino dads singing karaoke and I have a little laugh about it. I think it's funny. <laughs> and they, they sing songs like Oh here she come. Watch out boy. Choo -choo -ya. <laughs> what did I just hear? <laughs> I, I love oh, it just because of how specific it is. That you don't know what you've got till she's gone. <laughs> I can't stand... There's stuff in jabs that I would like to watch, but I can't stand... <laughs> I fucking can't do it. Uh.